Claude is my go-to model for writing and coding. Now, if you configure it correctly, it's probably your best copywriter because I find it has the most natural tone. GPT is probably my second favorite over all the models, followed by Gemini, and I don't really like Grok for copywriting, but it's very good for other things. Claude 4, and I'm not a coder, but some of my team members are, is great for coding. In fact, this dashboard that you're viewing right now, we coded on Claude's interface. So that just proves that you can generate infographics, you can generate things with real use cases already using Claude. It can create apps and documents, it has a projects feature for complex workflows, and it has a code terminal integration if you want to go even deeper with your coding. So it's very good for both of those tasks. Its limitations are it doesn't have image gen like some of the other models. The max tier costs $100 to $200 a month, which you'll probably need because coding can be quite intensive. And the pro tier only has 40 to 80 hours weekly. So once again, if you're a power user, it does become quite expensive. It's also not the best at research. There are better models for that. But Claude is my go-to in my daily life for anything regarding soft coding. Once again, I'm not like a deep coder, but I create infographics. I create spreadsheets to track certain things in my life. For example, you can do an expenses tracker quite well on Claude. If you're doing a property development, you can get data for the property and the rental yield on Claude. It's really good for that sort of stuff. And you can even use a better research model like the ones we're about to get into. And you can combine Claude. So get the data from another LLM and then put it into Claude to create the visual representation. 